LOJ TV family. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. The death of Whitney Houston has came to me as a surprise. I mean, I, I am literally surprised at this. I'm not going to talk too long. Um, I'm just really, truly in shock right now, and I can't even put this together. I mean, I'm... Um, they're saying that she died, that she that she drowned in the bathtub at the hotel. Um, here's the clip right now. Um, okay. We begin with Amy Powell live at the Beverly Hilton with details on Houston's death and an exclusive look at the last video of Houston performing in the early hours yesterday. Amy. Giovanna, Whitney Houston was once considered one of the greatest voices in pop music, but in recent years her music career was overshadowed by drug problems. Tonight, her longtime friend and mentor Clive Davis told people gathered here at the hotel for a celebration that Houston was looking forward to this event and would have wanted the music to go on. Legendary music industry executive Clive Davis embraces singer Alicia Keys outside the Beverly Hilton Hotel. Davis, who helped launch Whitney Houston's career, and others gathering for a pre-Grammy Award celebration are stunned by her death. Fans and the media started gathering around the hotel as the news spread. Houston was a guest at the hotel. Beverly Hills police say they received a 911 call at 343 this afternoon. Our officers arrived on scene in about two minutes. Uh, fortunately, the fire department was already on scene for a pre-Grammy party. So when we got here, the fire department and the hotel security was in her hotel room. Uh, they attempted resuscitation measures. Minutes later, at 355, Houston was pronounced dead. Authorities say she was found in a bathtub. She has an entourage with her family, friends, and co-workers, and in fact, they were the ones that positively identified her to us. Thursday night, the 48-year-old singer was photographed attending a Grammy party. The party was at True Nightclub in Hollywood. In this exclusive video, Houston grabs the microphone and performs. <laughs> years, Houston had publicly talked about her struggles with drug abuse. Investigators say there are no obvious signs of what caused her death. Our detectives are going to follow up on this and the first thing to determine is whether or not uh, it was natural causes or um, some other cause of death. The investigation into Whitney Houston's tragic death continues at this hour. The coroner's office will officially list her cause of death. Reporting live in Beverly Hills, Amy Powell, ABC7 Eyewitness News.